Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April the 23rd of 2021. Well, it is titled flying over the Earth at night too. So what do we see here? Well, this is going to be a video clip from several years ago taken from the International Space Station on a number of images as it looks at the Earth at night. Now the International Space Station orbits around Earth every 90 minutes. So it's 45 roughly 45 minutes of day and 45 minutes of night for each day on the International Space Station. So we will get to see that and as we begin to play the video let's go ahead and take a look at this and the first thing that you'll see is some of the aurora off to the left and the green and reddish colors of the aurora as particles are excited by the uh, from the uh, particles in the atmosphere are excited by the sun and actually um, excited by charged particles from the sun. Then as we see we are traveling over a part of the United States so you can make out a little bit of that there as you go through and as you head up towards the east coast you'll see the panhandle and the peninsula of Florida sticking out there as we fly over that and head off into the Caribbean. So then we'll see a second section which is looking at Europe and you can note there you see France and Spain as we first do it and then we'll go over the boot of Italy as we head off into the Mediterranean Sea and then we begin to see the coast of Africa down below and including the very illuminated here Nile River as being in the middle of the desert there most of the area is concentrated right around that river so you can see the path of that as we begin to fly over Africa. So some of the things that you can see uh, include the, the what we've talked about here as well as a number of lightning storms that are there. Uh, as present you can see the flashes of lightning that occur. And you can also see again the earth and how much light pollution there is how much the very populated areas stand out quite a bit as we started off you saw the western more western and middle sections of the US much less populated and darker areas and then as you hit towards the east coast of the United States you can see that it's much much brighter and everything is illuminated there and as you come into the very eastern portion very bright and very few very really dark areas present and we can see a lot of that as we travel there and then as we looked at in Europe you can see the same thing all of the major cities highlighted and very bright and very few really dark areas that are well away from any of these bright regions. Now when we travel over Africa then you'll see a lot more dark regions with the Sahara Desert much less populated and much less light there. So you can see some very dark areas as well when you travel over there and when you're away from the uh, Nile River. So you get to see a number of things there as we watch this image taken from the International Space Station as we fly over uh, the Earth at night. So that was our picture of the day for April the 23rd of 2021. It was titled Flying Over the Earth at Night 2. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.